Question 17. Chloe spent one sixth of her money on a dress and two blouses. The cost of the dress is three times the cost of each blouse, which means to say that the blouse costs a unit and the dress costs three units. If you were to go back to the first statement, she would have actually spent three units plus two units here, a total of five units on a dress and two blouses. And part A of the question, what fraction of her money did Chloe spend on a blouse? Now the blouse cost her one unit, and given that she spent one sixth of her money on five units, to find out how much she spent on the blouse, which is one unit, we just simply take one over six, divide by five, and you will get one over 30 as your answer for part A. So Chloe spent one over 30 of her money on the blouse. Now we can also find out the fraction of her money that she spent on the dress by simply taking 1 over 30 times 3 because the dress costs 3 times as much as a blouse so you will get 1 over 10 for the dress and this 1 over 30 was for the blouse that we found earlier on Moving on, she bought a watch with 3 quarter of her remaining money so we can take 3 quarter times 5 over 6 which is the remaining money and we will get 5 over 8 now this answer means that Chloe spent 5 over 8 of all her money on a watch given that the watch costs $220.50 more than the dress we have to find out the difference in fraction between the watch and the dress first and the answer here is 21 over 40 so you can interpret this as the difference between a watch and a dress is 21 units and the total amount of money that Chloe has is 40 units at first and with that we can solve part B of the question how much money did Chloe have at first? so we're going to take um, $220.50 divide by 21 to find out what's one unit and then we multiply 40 which is what she has in total in terms of units and that will give us $420 as our answer for part B